life is too short just to be average. Especially as a team, if you want to supersede your competitors, you better have a competitive culture. It better be every day. It's the competitive nature that drove us. Success does not come easy. Don't stop. We're joined now by three-time Super Bowl champ and ESPN NFL analyst, Darren Woodson. Hi, I'm Darren Woodson, former Dallas safety, three-time world champ, and current pro football analyst. Darren, you earned the reputation of being a hard hitter. You were a captain for the Cowboys, 13 seasons with Dallas. What are your memories of playing for the boys? It wasn't so much about the individual part of it. It was about the team aspect and, and us winning championships. I'm going with the Cowboys this way. I think it starts the running game. And here you go with the Cowboys. <laughs> Darren Whitson says he remembers the day he first walked into Texas Stadium and saw the Ring of Honor. I looked up and I said, you know, one of these days I want to be up there. Today's on the ring, number 28, Darren Whitson! We're going to be surrounded by those who sharpen you, who push you to the limit, who make you become a better football player and a better person on and off the field. There are four levels of commitment. And it applies not only in your business life, but in your family life. Number one is existent. When you're existent, you're just there. And then there's those people that are compliant. I'm going to show up. When they tell me to show up, I'm going to act like they want me to act. I'm going to dress like the, the way they want me to dress, but I'm not going to do anything else. I'm not going to make this business any better. And then there's committed. You're going to make sure the boss knows that, hey, I'm all the way in, guys. I'm here. But let me tell you the one I like. That person that's compelled. When it's game time, you look to your right and you know that guy that's compelled. You're like, yeah, we're going to war today. Here we go. He's got my back. Look at yourself, look within yourself and find out who are you? Am I committed to doing the job that I'm doing or am I compelled? And that's what I'm asking you guys today. Who are you? You want someone to go from existent to compelled, you have to keep them on your hip and guide them. Be a leader.